When famous athletes win championships, they sometimes famously declare I'm going to Disney World. Then there's Donald Trump. At the end of the worst week he's had thus far in his illegitimate presidency, Trump decided to visit a different land of make-believe, a border wall that doesn't exist. On Friday, Donald Trump visited the town of Calexico. It's a nice enough place, but we doubt Trump picked it because of any of its finer attributes. Instead, considering how weak his knowledge is of the U.S.-Mexico border, he once incorrectly placed San Antonio on the border, we're guessing he chose Calexico simply because it sounded like a place that might be on the California-Mexico border. Sure enough, if only by pure luck, he's right. The trouble, he's not building any wall there. That didn't stop from Trump from tweeting just checked out the new wall on the border, great. Who's he trying to fool here? There is no wall. Sure, his support base, consisting of low-information people who are eager to believe whatever sucker but lie he dishes out, undoubtedly lapped it all up. But everyone else just shook their heads, and not simply because Trump was wasting his time with utter nonsense. It's one thing for Donald Trump to do something as pointless as visiting an imaginary wall. Considering his near-total lack of a presidential work schedule, he does tend to have some time on his hands. But this is a week in which his political adversaries are aggressively pursuing his tax returns, his financial records, his security clearance scandal documents, and the Mueller report. At least some of these things will be unearthed rather soon, and it'll be very ugly for him. Instead of preparing for it, he's busy visiting his own version of Fantasyland.